In this video, we will continue using uh, MVVM on Zama Informs application. In the last video, we have created a user interface which contains the information about uh, the task. So you remember the task contains a title and a duration. We have wrote those values on our uh, user interface here using our uh, home view model. In this video, what I want to do is to change these values here. So, for example, changing here, creating UX, for example, uh, changing the text, then um, ch then reflecting this modification on our um, task model uh, property here uh, of the view of the home view model. So there is two steps to do. The first one is to implement I notify property change it inside our uh, view model. I notify property change it. The implementation will contains a property called property change it, then a method. You don't have to understand this code, but what it does actually is refreshing the user interface and every time our uh, our model changes and reflect the modification from the user interface back to our view model. The other thing to do is to support this um, property changes inside our uh, property. For that, I'll go and make the task model change it with a backing field. So that I can change the implementation of the set method. For the set method, now and every time I, I change the task model, I want to reflect this modification to the user interface. For that, I call the on property changed method, which is added um, after implementing the inotify property uh, changed. The second thing to do is to go to the user interface and here as I want to reflect the title back to the view model I can do that by typing mode equal to way the same thing for the duration I, I type mode equal to way so now I can type on my user interface and those modifications will be reflected to uh, to my task model. So now let's uh, let's uh, see the, these uh, changes and actions. So for that, I'll go and create a button. Let's give it a text save um, save task for example. And now inside my button, what we have previously done is implementing the click it uh, event handler. But now as I'm using um, MVVM, I can do the same thing using command. So for my command, I go and bind to a command. The command I'm going to use here, I'll call it save command, for example. Now when um, the platform looks for save command, it should find it on my home view model. So here I go and create the command property. I call it save command. And my save command, which is of type command, will uh, get will be executed and every time I type I press uh, this button. And the action it will do will be implemented inside the get method. So as it returns a type of uh, command, and here I type the action. It can take a parameter for, but for my case I don't need a parameter. So what I want to do here is that I want to um, to show the um, the title and the duration value of the task model inside another property. For that, I'll create a property 
of type string and I call it message for example the message also implements the own property changes by uh, changing the implementation of this set adding on property change it so now I inside the message I'll get I'll show a message saying uh, your um, your task and concatenating with uh, the name task model dot title adding to it the duration plus task model dot duration saying it was um, successfully saved so here the message will contain this uh, information about the title and the duration of the task this message I want now to uh, show it inside my home page user interface for that I create a label and bind it to the text property binding and here I type the name of my property so let's ensure, make sure it have been um, typed correctly and let's run it So now I click save task. Now it's showing me the message your task create a new UI of value 2 was successfully uh, saved. The same for my Windows and Android application. Now let's change this one to the UX for example and the value here to, to be um, uh, 5 for example. Click and save task. You see here it's changing the value. So thank you.